Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars. And I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about uh, congenital uh, anomalies, the physical body. That means those that you're born with, right? Um, including what are classified as syndromes and diseases and abnormalities of the physical body compared to what other people experience as physical form. Um, I just, from my own standpoint, would like to explain uh, that there that there is a reason, right, for these things that occur, and that has to do with tangles in the etheric net, the subtle body called the etheric net, and these tangles take place because of soul wounding in past incarnations in those areas of the etheric net. So, when we find ourselves with physical anomalies. Uh, congenital physical anomalies, or uh, if we find ourselves prone to injury in a certain area of the body in this incarnation, uh, from my standpoint, what that means is that these are the areas to concentrate on in soul healing right now. That way we can prevent further um, uh, difficulties with those areas, and we can perhaps even participate in their regeneration and cure. One way to do that is to concentrate on the new chakra that's come in since the since the 2012 shift. And that is, of course, there are many new chakras coming in, which is very cool. But the one I'm thinking about is associated with the thymus gland. Since the heart is uh, the fourth chakra, old style, and the throat is the fifth chakra, old style, and the thymus gland is located in the mid-chest, in the mid-high chest, here, right? I would consider it old style to be something like chakra uh, 4.5, right? <laughs> I'm sure everything will get renumbered one of these times. Um, but so, for the thymus gland, the color I hear is magenta. And in, in uh, lower forms of life, the thymus gland is, is responsible, as I understand it, for regenerating uh, or whole organs like in a lizard, uh, when the lizard's tail it falls off as a defense mechanism during uh, attack by, say, a bird or like that, then uh, the, the thymus gland is what assists the lizard in, um, in growing a new tail. And that's true also of, of some sorts of lower animals that can regrow various parts of themselves. Uh, so, so the theory is that this... Um, capability exists in dormant state in humankind. And the new light coming in, the incoming light of, of, of the awake, Great Awakening, it will allow changes and uploads uh, uh, new wear in, for the thymus gland, 4.5 chakra, the, uh, the, the chakra between the fourth and the fifth, uh, so that it can remember those abilities of complete physical regeneration. That, of course, can't happen without a clearing of soul wounding, without repairs to the etheric net, which is like the blueprint or template for the physical body. So, so concentrating on the color magenta, or on this spot, on the thymus gland, and on total physical regeneration. And also, I think the healing light of St. Germain, which deals with magenta, so you can look to that ascended master for help in your in your physical physical healing. So that's what I have for now, and um, I wish you the very best. Have a wonderful day.